It's our big summer road trip. Welcome to Stonehenge. Let's take a look around. The prehistoric monument of Stonehenge is one of Britain's most recognizable landmarks. Its standing stones date back to the late Neolithic period around 2500 BC. A cultural icon, Celtic pagans known as Druids are thought to have built the site as a place of worship. Although access to the English heritage property is now by ticket only, Stonehenge is still seen as a shrine to those who celebrate the longest day of the year, the summer solstice. So it's taken us two hours to drive here and once you've safely parked your car you head into the visitor centre and we've got a miles trek ahead of us before we even reach the stones. The visitor centre includes a shop and cafeteria and houses probably similar to those around the time of the Neolithic era when Stonehenge was built. Yeah, it's quite a, it's quite a track. I think it's over one mile. Feels like about five. Hmm, let's get walking. We're still walking. Marcus is fed up with the walk. We're walking. Seems a long distance away. Um, yeah, hopefully the view will be worth it. I've been there about three. Um, I have been to Stonehenge about two times already. But this is the first time that I've had to do this walk. Well, they say that you need to get the steps in, so that's what we're doing. But when you eventually do reach the stone circle, it is a magnificent sight to behold. It's unbelievable how these stones were erected or the millennia ago and it just we don't know the origins of it we don't know why it was done we don't know how it was done they haven't fallen in throughout the centuries and it's just marvelous how something like this is still standing and it, it and it attracts so many people especially during the solstice the summer solstice the winter solstice it's a place where people have some spirituality and it has this calming effect on you and it's just lovely seeing it and yeah i yeah this is my third time now and yeah i <laughs> every few years i do like coming so take it all in people if you don't fancy a walk back, there's always the bus behind me. We're on the bus now. Well, I wasn't going to walk back. 